This latest mass shooting at Michigan State takes an emotional toll on all of us. We mourn for the victims and we worry about whether our loved ones could be next. Fox 2's Dina Stenefani is speaking to a psychiatrist who's sharing some insight into how we can effectively cope with this tragedy. No matter how you watched or felt the events unfolding in East Lansing, many of us share a similar perspective, and that is shock. The immediate impact is, for, for many people, is just going to be shock. Just, ever, you know, when we're going through our day-to-day -day routine, we have the sense of, of safety and comfort, and this kind of shatters that. Just more than a year ago, Beaumont behavioral health psychiatrist Jeffrey Gunay was in Oxford to counsel students after the mass shooting at Oxford High School. He explains how so much anxiety can stem from fear of the unknown. That can give people a sense of loss of control, uh, a fear of the unknown. What's going to happen? Is this going to happen again? Am, am I, uh, will I ever be safe again? For parents who want to reassure children, but it's hard to find the right words because you two are struggling, that's okay. I think it's okay for kids to see parents be upset and show emotion. I don't think it's necessary to, to try to bury that and hide that. I think we can, as parents, can model for our kids um, how to have emotions and deal with them healthily and talk about it and communicate it and work through it with our loved ones. Communicate, that's key. Now, what specific words you use or how much detail you give, that depends on each situation, each age. But don't avoid the topic. There is moderation. We don't want people nonstop on their phones uh, reading about this and doing nothing else and thinking nothing else. But at the same time, we don't want people totally avoiding talking about this. And so I think it's really important for um, those who went through it to seek their support system, whether it's family, friends, maybe a therapist, clergy, whoever that support system is for you to, to talk about this and process it. When life events do make it feel like things are just out of your control, one of the recommendations is to control what you can. That would be self-care, meaning eat healthy foods, try and get some sleep, exercise, go for a walk, and connect with people who give you comfort. The idea is that you're taking care of your physical and emotional well-being. That's HealthWorks. I'm Dina Santafanti. In the way